So believe it or not, the White House's Secret Service agents used to actually look like this. That is until they got absolutely destroyed by the public. And it would result in one of the most embarrassing stories in American history. Basically, during Richard Nixon's presidency in the early 1970s, he was so impressed by how fancy the palace guards looked in Europe that he decided the White House back home needed something that looked just as good. So he immediately ordered that a new uniform be designed for his Secret Service agents. This new uniform was extremely regal with a gold shoulder trim, a double-breasted tunic, and a massive hat. But although President Nixon really liked this new design, unfortunately for him, literally no one else did. The moment these new Secret Service uniforms were unveiled to the public, people began to make crazy comments like, they're like Nazi uniforms, like extras from a Lithuanian movie, like a palace guard full of toy soldiers, and so much more. Even the guards themselves hated their new uniforms, describing them as being too theatrical and the hats as being too uncomfortable. So with all this backlash, funny enough, less than a month later, all the new uniforms were quietly removed. These uniforms would later be sold to a high school marching band in Iowa for just $5 a piece. 